Welcome to Glenridge at Garden Villas. I'd like to share a few things about Glenridge with you and take you on a little tour. Glenridge is an independent living community for Christian scientists and their spouses located within Garden Villas, a full service retirement community open to the general public. This arrangement allows Glenridge to offer the maximum space and amenities with low overhead. There are no entrance or endowment fees. Garden Villas is located in West St. Louis County, close to the Principia School and First Church of Christ Scientist Town and Country. This is actually the back side of Garden Villas with the lake which you can see from the balconies of the apartments on the east side of the building. When you turn in at the Garden Villas West sign, just a bit further down the drive, you come to the front entrance. This covered area protects passengers from the elements as they are picked up and dropped off. The Garden Villas bus takes residents to local stores banks, Sunday church, and some Principia school events. On Wednesdays, there are special outings to places like museums and parks. Here's the front door. Welcome to Garden Villas. Let's go inside. The lobby is the heart, the active center of the building. Let's get oriented. As you enter, on your right, one of the friendly receptionists is at the desk to greet you. Someone is here around the clock. The hall just beyond the desk leads to apartments. The walkway takes you to the game room and additional apartments beyond. The elevator directly across from the entrance takes you to the apartments on the upper level or down to the dining room, the multi-purpose room, the laundry room, the beauty and barber salon, and the storage area on the lower level. If we peek behind the elevator, there's a waiting area on the main level where you'll often find people working on puzzles. On the upper level pictured here, there's a library and a computer area. There's a resident book club, and the bookmobile comes twice a month. Every level has a fireplace similar to this one. Private mailboxes filled by a U.S. postal worker are beside the front door. The hall on our right takes you to the Garden Villas office, and immediately beyond is our Glenridge office and study room the heart of our Glenridge community. Glenridge residents gather here weekday mornings for the Bible lesson with volunteers, and we share ideas, often visiting for a while afterwards. This is also our reading room with Mary Baker Eddy's published writings, biographies, and books on Christian science, as well as Bible reference books and current periodicals. The room is always open, seven days a week, 24 hours a day, offering a quiet place for research, study, and prayer. We also have a kitchen for our parties, as well as refreshments for our monthly Bible trivia get-togethers and monitored discussion groups. And here's Stephanie Aliotto, our Executive Director busy in her office. She does an outstanding job of supporting residents and communicating with everyone. Would you like to see an apartment now? There are three styles, studio, one bedroom, and two bedroom. Studio apartments have a sleeping area with a generous closet in an alcove off the living room. One bedroom apartments like this display have a lovely living room with a door opening to the bedroom on one side. 
two-bedroom apartments are identical to the one-bedroom style, but with a second bedroom, closet, and bathroom across the living room from the first. And they also have laundry facilities. In this view, you can see the door to the hall outside on the right, the coat closet, and the area leading to the bathroom, as well as the bedroom's location. Residents bring their own furniture and may bring their small pets too. Cable TV is included, and every apartment has a call box which reaches staff 24 7. If you are interested, you are invited to stay for a three day, two night complimentary visit. Every ground level apartment has a patio, so you can just step outside to enjoy beautiful days or take your dog for a walk. All other apartments have a large balcony like this, lots of room for a small table, chairs, and plants. All apartments have the wide sliding door. Each apartment has a kitchen with a full-sized refrigerator, dishwasher, and sink. There's a stove with an oven and range, a countertop microwave oven, and lots of cabinets. The bedrooms easily accommodate a queen-sized bed, bureau, and chair. Garden Villas provides weekly housekeeping and flat linen service. Between the bedroom and bathroom, there is a walk-through closet with a six-foot shelf that has hanger space beneath. Extra shelving is available if you wish to add another shelf or two below. The bathroom has all the necessities. We've pulled back the shower curtain to show you the step-in shower. Just beyond the toilet, the wide cutout provides easy access. There's an abundance of light over the vanity. Let's visit the game room before we head downstairs to look at all the other facilities. We'll take the path beside the elevator. On the way, we can peek at the dining room below. Isn't that a nice view of the fountain in the middle of the lake? In the game room, there are usually people playing cards or rummy cube games or working on puzzles. Can you see the table way at the back? I wonder how many puzzles are stacked on it. Anyway, now let's go see what's on the lower level. Getting off the elevator downstairs, you can check the menu and see all the activities for the day. The monthly calendar in the bulletin left at each apartment tells about all the various events, talks, and bus trips. The aptly named multi-purpose room is on our right. Many of you have been here for our previous annual meetings, talks, and Christmas parties. But this is also used for sing-alongs, bell choir, crafts like jewelry making, and exercising. The refreshment center tucked in this corner is convenient for the various holiday parties as well as meet and greets. The room is also used for cultural talks and monthly visits with the staff and management. There are matinees on Fridays with popcorn and pop. Saturdays and Sundays are movie nights. Each time they show a different major movie. Just inside the dining room, iced tea, lemonade, ice water, coffee, fruit and crackers are always available for those in-between meal snacks. The dining room is light and airy with its three-storied windows and view of the lake. As you can see, there's even a piano for special occasions. The dinner meal, which is included, is prepared by an executive chef. 
Breakfast and lunch are available for an additional fee. There are even picnics on the water's edge outside occasionally. The ice cream parlor is just beyond the dining room and is available anytime your sweet tooth gets hungry. And fittingly, just beyond the ice cream parlor is the fitness center, in case you overindulged. Purified water is available while you exercise. Down the hall, opposite the multipurpose room, we pass the laundry room, which has three washers and dryers. No coins are needed here. You can make an appointment at the beauty and barber salon. Residents in each apartment can keep seasonal items in the storage room. And finally, for those with a green thumb, there's even a small greenhouse. I hope you have enjoyed our little tour. If you have any questions or would like to come for an in-person tour or even a short stay to experience it for yourself, just contact Stephanie. Here's her contact information.